never so impressive. And he's going to face tonight, earn this match. Not many people know him yet. If you don't, you might want to hit your DVRs because this guy is real. People certainly know him here in PCW, and what a statement-making victory he had. I really got to believe he was the underdog in that triple threat match with Joey Janela and Leo Rush, but he got the win, and he earned his shot at destiny here tonight. And Lord, you have traded a lot of words on social media. There's no love loss with you. You gotta think on top of that with the title on the line. This could get very, very interesting. Amber Stone is an alpha male. And Douglas James is, is a hell of a, a good guy, an all around guy. I mean, Douglas James will beat your ass. But he happens to be one of those, you know, kind of guys you can have a beer with. Hammerstone, complete opposite. Let's listen to Dan Masters. <laughs> I'm sure the difficulties here. Something doesn't feel right. What the, what the hell is, is that, who's that, that is Mr. 450, man who never, never lost the light heavy, heavyweight title, what the hell is he doing here, he looks like he's moving around pretty good, Mr. 450, the, the light heavyweight champion, or he, or, or, he I thought he, he's he was, in this, Todd. he was or is he, well, he he had to be here and able to defend. I don't know if he's medically cleared. But he's certainly here. Well, I told you it was going to get pretty interesting, didn't I? Well, he has something to say. Some technical difficulties here. Mr. Forfeit. Shocked that he would even show up here. Hammerstone and James if 450 was not medically cleared, but the champ is indeed here. And we've got ourselves a triple threat match. And all three of these men have a claim to the title. 450 being the champion. It was told to the fans, it was told to Douglas James, to Alexander Hammerstone, that 450 was injured and that they were the mutual number one contenders for that title. Well, 450 was injured. He tore his meniscus. He had surgery. I, I just think looking at the timetable, nobody expected him back. But my goodness, he must have rehabbed the hell out of it. And he's here and he's defending the title. He said, if you're going to take this championship, you're going through me. 450 with that cartwheel. Duck under. Bypass. Oh, wow. And Douglas James showing exactly why people are so impressed with him. That perfect form drop kick. And now James. James flies! Drop kick so good, he put it on a t-shirt and now takes flight to the outside. Douglas James, can he win his second consecutive triple threat match this time to take home the gold? James now going directly after the champion. Lifting 450 to a vertical base, sending him to the middle of the ring. 450 recovers. And 
Christian, when you have a triple threat matchup like this, you got to hear what's going on the other side. You got to take advantage. You got to divide and conquer. And that's exactly right. I mean, genius for these two men to try to isolate Hammerstone on the outside and turn this into a one on one contest for just a moment. Springboard, arm drag. Incredible. I cannot believe that 450 was able to return and now an arm drag the other way by Douglas Hicks. Both guys looking for the drop kick. Neither man hits it. And Hammerstone again. Boy, does the mood change when he hits the ring. Look at Hammer now, stalking the champion, stalking Douglas James. Double kick now, and James and 450 getting together. Oh, man, and Hammerstone throwing both men to the wind. In essence, a double Japanese arm drag there by Hammerstone. Again, the power on display. Power you don't normally see in the light heavyweight division. Stone came into this matchup with a right. He thinks he's the uncrowned champion. He had to jump a couple hurdles. Beat Martinson, you know, and then beat the Oracle. He had two. In essence, he had two number one contenders matches. Hammerstone charges in. Big clothesline on James. And now one for the champion, Mr. 450. Again for James. And back and forth is Hammerstone. Successful weight cut, had a chance to rehydrate. I mean, what do you think he's walking around in that ring now? Well, earlier this evening on Facebook Live, on Pacific Coast Wrestling's Facebook account, he weighed in at 214 pounds. He could easily be 220, and showing it now with the strength, carrying two men like they're infant babies wow. and tossing them down. Samoa drop, fall away slam in stereo. You know, I had a chance to speak to Hammerstone earlier in it was an incredible conversation. I mean, we talked about independent press wrestling. We talked about Hammerstone being above that and that he's one of the only professional wrestlers. A lot of guys would take a gripe with that. You know, for him to walk up. We are local. What I mean by that is you can come sit down with us. You're not going to be on the Internet talking to someone in St. Louis or Florida. We're focused on Oregon and Washington, being the Northwest PA one specialist. A big reward in this is serving the veteran. We have a culture here that's very well educated on the VA law. And it's all said and done with these people in homes that have gone to bat for us and served us. It is nice to be able to say, now we're serving you. T-Mobile is upgrading its network at a record pace. We were the first to bring 5G nationwide. And now that Sprint is a part of T-Mobile, we're turning up the speed. Upgrading over a thousand towers a month with ultra capacity 5G to bring speeds as fast as the Wi Fi to cities and towns across America. And we're adding more every week. Coverage and speed. Who says you can't have it all? Your dog is your best friend. But your dog's best friend is your ex-girlfriend. Because she always has irresistible pepperoni. Be your best friend's best friend. Finding love shouldn't be a stretch. That's why I trust e harmony. I'm done with swiping. There's a better way. That's why I trust eHarmony. I deserve better than swipe right or swipe left. That's why I trust eHarmony. When it comes to connecting with someone real, compatibility matters. That's why every 14 minutes, someone finds love on eHarmony. Download the app and start free today. Everyone loves to save a bundle. And when you bundle your home and auto with Allstate, you can save up to 25%. Protect more, pay less. Saving is easy when you're in good hands. Click or call for a quote today. years, one man was the epicenter of news, entertainment, and a whole lot of laughs. Not to mention the guests, Betty White, Carrie Fisher, Oprah Winfrey, 
Miss Piggy, Billy Crystal, Richard Pryor, Goldie Hawn, Joan Rivers, Carol Burnett, Eddie Hardy, Carl Ryder, Jerry Seinfeld, Ellen's Generous, David Letterman, Jay Leno. Watch it all on Johnny Carson TV, a new channel dedicated entirely to the godfather of late night. Stream it on your iPhone, Android device, or computer. How hot was it? You'll have to tune in to find out. If you have COVID-19 right now, what do these potential treatments mean for you? There is hope, and this drug is hope personified to every person with the disease. When could this therapeutic drug be available? The first potential treatment we should be able to know is a scientific community in the next few weeks. We'll see you right back here tomorrow, because we're all in this together. Around and say that he's the only pro and that everybody else is indie. It, it, it's bullshit. And, and quite frankly, the guys in the locker room are starting to turn on him. A lot of guys don't like this cocky kid. Mr. 450 was the first Triple Crown champion in Puerto Rico, winning all the three major promotions, light heavyweight titles. So I don't think you can say 450, someone who's wrestled all around the globe, is not a professional wrestler. But that's what I'm trying to tell you. And that's what I tried to tell the kid Hammerstone. I mean, he's a young, good-looking, successful professional wrestler. But to try to bury everybody else, to try to say that no one is as good as him, these guys are indie, that Douglas James is just a 112-pound indie guy. There's an interview going up with me and Hammerstone. You have to watch it. The kid is as arrogant as ever. At 450 now. Yeah, 450 he might just, yeah, he might hammer that arrogance right out of him. Full head of steam. And a drop kick by Hammerstone. Taking a little page out of my heavyweight playbook showing he can go as well. Douglas James now cross body. But the momentum takes him over and the power again comes into play and it just might be the difference maker. We do everything we can. Look at Hammerstone's power. Oh, wow, just tossing James into 450. But it's a cover and a two count. Hammerstone breaking it up. We do everything we can here at Pacific Coast Wrestling to manage the light heavyweight division. We even decided to put the weigh-ins on the day of the event. But there's just no way that that guy is still 214 pounds like he was this morning when he got here. No chance. And again, in the triple threat matchup, and you saw it earlier, Hammerstone throwing Douglas James into 450, but then had to quickly break up the pin. First pinfall or submission is going to win the matchup and take home the title. And the current champion, although coming in tonight, we didn't think it would be the case. Mr. 450 does not even have to be involved in the decision to lose the title. 450, coming back off injury, how much is that playing into this? How much is 450's bad knee, injury, of course, in the, in the cruiserweight division of the WWE recently, how much does that affect him? Popping right up there with a slap, and it looks like his knee's just behind. Well, I think he, he was like a man possessed. He was not going to have that title stripped. He defied the odds. I mean, he was not. The, the, the calendar just did not add up for him to be back here tonight with the severity of his, his injury. Well, but he is here and he's defending the gold, Chris. That's a great observation, Todd. Just, just a week ago, we thought he was definitely out. And nope, here he is. An incredible shock for these PCW fans who showed up here. And now Douglas James in a bad spot there. And assisted Enzi off that top rope. 450. What a run he's had right here at PCW. And uh oh, look out here. Somebody call Indiana Jones. Thought maybe we're going to have a little Tower of Doom. Instead, Hammer elected to pull 450 off and now back into the corner. Hammerstone ripping down 450. And the champion, Mr. 450, now. Oh my God. An incredible kick there by Alexander Hammerstone. Hammerstone's starting to dominate. He is making this match his pace. He has slowed it down to a methodical pace where he can absolutely bruise and batter his two opponents. Superplex rolls through. Not done yet. What is he going to do here? Into an election chair. Going to try and execute him. And both men landed awkwardly there. I guess it looks as if Douglas James was able to counter somehow. Flip pile driver now. And all three are down, Christian. Everybody selling out. PCW light heavyweight title on the line. James, James 
James controlling the action most recently. James needs to pull that fighting spirit out from his gut. Although he's a youngster, although he's new to the professional wrestling scene, James now. James, much like Willie Mack when he competed for the heavyweight title, he's a hometown hero. The fans here, just he's a sentimental favorite in this matchup for certain. Now, big forearms. Hear him. All the way over here, about 100 feet from the ring where we stand in our commentary position. And a little trash talk for 450 and an answer. And now trading. Big elbows in the center of the ring. And again, you'd have to think that Hammerstone would have the advantage here. But 450 refuses to back down. He didn't back down to injury. He's not backing down to Hammerstone, but he might not have a choice. All oh, that knee compromised, but holding up. Oh, what a shot by the champion. And it feels good to still say that as he goes for the cover. And 450 with that incredible Pele kick to the, to the kidneys of Hammerstone. And James now coming out of it, trying to take advantage with 450 fights off. 450. Oh my God. What the hell was that? That was awesome. And Douglas James has had incredible counter wrestling ability in this matchup. Now the roll up. And much like Callahan trying to just go rudimentary to get the win. When all oh, those fails go back to fundamentals, or if you're Hammerstone, go to your freakish strength. The power of Hammerstone. Lifting him with one arm, having the strength and the remaining stamina to be able to slam Douglas James back down to the ring. And now who will recover first? I'll tell you what, I sure as hell don't want to see a count out as Hammerstone gets back to his feet first. You know, and in essence, does 450 have somewhat of, his, of an advantage? He's been, he has had been laser focused. He's been counting down the days trying for this matchup. Douglas James and Hammerstone certainly did not prepare for 450 here. Neither of them knew it. So it was an equal disadvantage for James and Hammerstone. The advantage tonight goes to the champion. And 450 with an NZ answer. Oh, wow. And a, and a shining wizard, a flying knee from Douglas James who rolls underneath. And a big super kick. Douglas James was able to divide and conquer that previous triple threat match, and he's looking good here. Is tonight his night? He's three seconds away from making history. Not yet. No. You can see the look on Douglas James's face. How much does he have left? How much does the youngster have? You couldn't have asked for a better opportunity because 450 was unable to make a save. Guillotine attempt now. The MMA background playing now. But Hammerstone with a beautiful counter attempting that. Oh, incredible. The nightmare pendulum. Yes. Is it going to win him the gold? He, you know, smart move by Hammerstone. He saw the 450 was coming in, but now a low bridge. 450 with his head on a swivel. Suicide dive to the outside. 450. Straights to say, but the champion steals it. Wow. Sorry, folks. There's pieces for just a second as, as Dan Masters attempted to announce the winner. The winner is 450 still light heavyweight champion. The unpredictable nature of this. Today's discussion will be around sliced meat. Mom's luck healthy and affordable. Land of Ross Premium. No added hormones either. It's the only protein I've really melted with. Uh -huh. Land of Frost Premium. Fresh look, same great taste. At Jackson Hewitt, we offer safe and easy ways to file with a skilled tax pro. Securely drop off your documents, have them picked up, or upload them and work as a tax pro online from home. Safe and easy ways to file that work around you. Come on. Great. 
Maybe just a cable? We can help you. Welcome to America's number one battery destination, AutoZone, your battery solution. You already have enough to keep up with in your life, like that intense new show that everyone is talking about. So let us keep one worry off your plate. Introducing Hyundai Complimentary Maintenance, the basic services your new Hyundai needs for three years or 36,000 miles. Now, on every new 2020.